Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we are looking at developer and mobile tools uh, that are commonly used with Azure. So the first on the list is Azure Signal R service, and this is a real-time messaging service, not to be confused uh, with Azure's notification service. This is for easily adding real-time web functionality to applications. So if you ever heard of Pusher, it's just like Pusher. So um, that is the equivalent there. The next we have is Azure App Service. So easy to use service for deploying and scaling web applications with .NET, Node.js, Java, Python, and PHP. I'm a bit sad I don't see Ruby in there, but what are you gonna do? Um, so it's for developers who wanna focus on building their web apps and not worry about the underlying infrastructure. So if you've ever used Heroku, think of it like that, but for Azure. Next you have a uh, uh, Visual Studio um, and Visual Studio is a code editor. It's it it's basically an IDE, an integrated development development environment designed for creating powerful, scalable applications for Azure. You might have heard of Visual Studio Code, uh, which is similar but different. Um, but I just wanted to make mention of Visual Studio here. Then you have uh, Xamarin. I think I'm pronouncing it right, and it's a mobile app framework. Um, it's for creating powerful and scalable native mobile apps in .NET and Azure. Um, and yeah, so that is the developer in mobile tools for Azure.